Hi friends and welcome back to the Baseball Card Illustrated channel. I'm Bronco, the PSA 11, and this, well, this is Buffalo Wild Wings, where we had some dinner after the Oak Creek Card Show. I'll show you a couple of the cards I picked up at the end of this video in the 10 cool new listings at the Baseball Card Illustrated eBay store, but we're also gonna go through the sales from the past week. We'll have a special guest showing off cards that he purchased from the eBay store, and maybe some other surprises, you never know. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. Hit the like button, leave a comment, and please subscribe if you haven't done so yet. Now, let's get to the cards. As Hank Williams Jr. used to ask, are you ready for some football? Well, I have none of that to offer you, but I do have some baseball cards, starting with a card that actually sold after I finished recording last week's video, but not quite officially on Monday. It's a Bobby Witt Jr. rookie card from Stadium Club Chrome. This is just really, really sharp and a really good looking card of the Royals emerging superstar. The second card today is the Wizard, Ozzy Smith. This is a Triple Threads card numbered to 340. Just another really sharp looking card here as we kind of wrap up the cards from Monday. But I'm gonna go out to one of my rowdy friends. It's the Oak Creek Card Show and this is Driller and the cards that he purchased today. We're at Fat Daddy's Card Show in Oak Creek, and this is the delivery service with a smile. This is Driller, and show us what you got here. Well, I picked up a Manny Ramirez Relic Auto. Old school Kirby, I'm sorry. Yeah, Kirby, KB Toys, Kirby. Good old KB, like KB together. Toys Pucket. A Chrome Future Stars Bobby Wood Jr., which is awesome. A 35th anniversary 88 style Garrett Mitchell rookie. My friend and here's everybody, Mr. Mike Trout, Top's Finest Flashbacks. Along with another one. And a 93 Top's Gold Larry Walker and Kirby Puckett All Star. Double the Hall of Famers for half the price. Yeah, yeah, you gotta <laughs> like that. I highly recommend checking out his store, people. I mean, this is proof in the pudding right here. Now, back to the Baseball Card Illustrated studio. I hope you enjoyed that look at Saturday at the Oak Creek Card Show. Now we're back to Monday, and this is a late sale that just came in. It's an Aaron Judge 2023 Topps Refractor, 35th anniversary of the 1988 design. It's two times two for Tuesday. Sorry, I know, math. So it's four cards getting shipped out. Up first, I think this is just one of the really cool underrated designs. You got Allen Iverson on this upper deck ovation card. You got like the imitation leather here that replicates the basketball. I don't know, it kind of works for me. Up next, we got Mookie Betts going back to his Red Sox days on this Topps Heritage card. Our third sale is his teammate. It's Clayton Kershaw. This is a 1989 design from the 2024 set. And this is from a silver pack. And last, but certainly not least, my pick for Rookie of the Year in the American League, it's Jackson Holiday. And here's another first Bowman from 2022. It's Wednesday. I'm spunky, and I like my oatmeal lumpy. If you understand that reference, leave a comment below and tell me what song I'm talking about there. Now let's get to the sales. We're going to start with some Showtime. It's Shoei Otani on a 2023 All Tops Team card from the 2024 Tops set. Up next, we're going to the NBA, and it's a rookie card of Al Horford. He's had an outstanding NBA career, and he started with the Hawks, and as you can see right here, 2007-8 Tops Rookie card. That's number 3 of 14. This one here is numbered to 299. It's Kutch, Andrew McCutcheon. It's a 1984 design. Pretty cool one, black borders, nice card. Now, speaking of nice cards, check this out. Jackson Holiday, one of the hottest cards on the market right now, is of the top prospect in baseball. And this right here is a Moonbeam card, or Mood Ring card, Mood Ring. I knew it had something to do with an M. Anyway, really nice card right there. I picked this up last weekend, and now I'm going to be shipping it out. This card I've had for a little bit of time in the store, but somebody has picked it up. It's a Ryan Mountcastle 
Major League Baseball Little League Classic Patch Card. Really cool stuff of Mounty from your Baltimore Orioles. And last but certainly not least, it's the kid, Ken Griffey Jr. They're celebrating him all year in 2024 tops. And this is him with the Reds going back to catch a fly ball. And it is number 18 in the series. It's Thursday and we're going with a four pack here. Starting with the great Nolan Ryan. And this is a Donruss Hollow. Pretty sharp looking card there. Kind of like that one. Up next, it's Big Poppy, David Ortiz. And this is a Trophy Hunters card from Stadium Club. I really like this because on the back, they actually talk about the accomplishments of the players. And as you can see here, David Ortiz, three World Series ring, three leader, league leaderships, and Ed, eight Edgar Martinez awards. Or was it Edgar Eight Martinez Awards? So I think that's what I was trying to say at first. Here's a guy that knows something about winning things. It's Ronald Acuna Jr. And that's a Gold Cup rookie card for the great outfielder from the Atlanta Braves. And last but not least, here's one of the best hitters we've seen. It's Ichiro. And this is a 2010 Topps card. Chrome style, if you would. Let's look at Thursday. Now let's Roll on into the weekend, starting with Friday's sales. It's time to celebrate TGA up in style with a five-pack, starting with Captain Vladimir Guerrero Jr. from Gypsy Queen. Next on deck, it's the great Ricky Henderson. I was a big fan of Ricky Henderson, one of the great leadoff hitters, in my opinion, the best leadoff hitter of all time. This is a Diamond Greats card, and he certainly fits that description. It's a die cut. Up next, one of the current greats of baseball, it's Mookie Betts, and this is back during his Red Sox days. Card number four, The Wizard, Ozzy Smith. Really cool design there. You can see him signing autographs on the Stadium Club card. Such great photography from Stadium Club, and a really nice card of him there. And out of the NBA, He's in motion. He's Jimmy Butler, and he's with the Philadelphia 76ers on this Panini Threads card from the 2018-2019 release. Now, let's go take a look at the weekend, and we'll see what cards sold while well, I was busy having fun at the Oak Creek Card Show. It was a record-setting day at the Oak Creek Card Show today. A ton of fun, 1,100 people plus through the doors. It was just fantastic. Now, let's take a look at the eBay sales for the Baseball Card Illustrated eBay store, starting with a card that I actually purchased this morning and sold before leaving the show today. It was Gabriel Moreno, and this is his Inception autograph card, number 249 of the then Toronto Blue Jay and current emerging star with the Arizona Diamondbacks. Up next, a guy that recently retired. It's the great center from the Philadelphia Eagles. It's Jason Kelsey. Checking in next, a guy not even thinking about retirement. It's Bobby Witt Jr. And this is his 2022 Topps rookie card from the Update series. Now, here's a guy that re fairly recently retired. It's Albert Pujols. And here's a little known fact. Albert Pujols and I have combined to hit 703 career Major League Baseball home runs. I'll let you figure out the breakdown on that total on your own. Here's another card that I was able to purchase early in the day, and it sold before the close of business, which is closing in at midnight. It's Bryce Harper, and this is one of those holiday foil cards from 2024 Topps Blaster Boxes. Speaking of 2024 Topps, here's an autographed card of Owen White, a rookie right-hander with the Texas Rangers. And this, as you can see on the back, he's a baseball star. And it's an autographed card as well. And speaking of stars, one of my favorite players, this is a sharp-looking card. It's the Big Hurt, Frank Thomas, and here you see him playing defense. That's a look at Saturday, and now we'll check in with Sunday and wrap up the video then with 10 cool new listings. It's time to wrap up the week with the sales from Sunday and then get to those 10 cool new listings at the Baseball Card Illustrated eBay store. And we'll start with a rookie card of TJ Friedel. You might remember him roaming the field with Chris Sabo and Eric Davis and oh wait no this is actually a 2022 archives rookie card 
Up next, your friend and mine, I had to steal that from our buddy Driller, it's Mike Trout on this 35th anniversary of the 1984 design from Topps. Moving to the world of basketball, this is a cool Steph Curry card. It's the King of Cards from Illusions. Coming up next, we've got Mookie Betts. A little way, way, way rave, I knew I was going to say that wrong. Card from Topps Chrome of the outfielder, infielder, catcher, pitcher, designated hitter, car parker, hot dog vendor, beer salesman. He does it all for the Met, for the Dodge, for the Mets, for the Dodgers. And it's a lot of fun to watch. And last but certainly not least, it's Nolan Ryan. And I guess we can call this, dating back to that era, a color match card. Because it the orange sort of matches his Astros uniform right there. Enough silliness. Let's get to the 10 cool new listings. All these currently available at the Baseball Card Illustrated eBay store. A link will be left in the description. We start with Mike Trout. This is a Topps Gold Label. Class 1, first class for the great Mike Trout. Up next, this is a card from Topps Finest. It's a blue chip card. Blue chips, in fact. Not the movie, but the great outfielder, Ronald Acuna Jr., this year might go for 70-70. Hopefully he can stay healthy. I know there's a little bit of issue with his knee. Hopefully he gets that figured out soon. Up next, this is a really cool card that I saw yesterday at the Oak Creek Card Show. Had to pick it up. It's a 2002 Topps card of Jose Canseco in his Expos uniform. If I'm not mistaken, he never actually played any game for the Expos. You can see that was certainly taken in spring training. I thought it was kind of cool. It's not in mint condition. It's not a 10 or anything like that, but it's pretty cool. There's the back. Kind of look at the corners. They're not perfect, but $1.99, leave me an offer for $1.75, and it's yours. Free shipping included. Speaking of 2024, I really wasn't, but I am now. It's Henry Davis, and this is one of those cards from a silver pack. A little Mojo Refractor action. Let's see if you can... Trying to move it in the light a little bit so you can see that, but I don't know if I did a great job. Here's a 2024 Topps autograph. This is Prelander Baroa from the Seattle Mariners. I hope I said that name right. And this is part of the Baseball Stars line. Speaking of Baseball Stars, not many were bigger during his career than Miguel Cabrera, the former Triple Crown winner and future Hall of Famer there with the Detroit Tigers from Bowman Platinum. Moving on to wrestling, we have The Man. I always think of that as being Ric Flair, but it's actually Becky Lynch on this Prism Base card. Going back to baseball, this is kind of a cool purple parallel here of Manny Machado from Archives. Or I should say Heritage, from Heritage. And it is not numbered. I figured I'd let you look at that. So there's one of the San Diego Padre infielder. Now... Do you know who this guy is? This is actually known as the mud guy. <laughs> he actually is the one that rubs the mud on all the baseballs that are used during baseball games. And his name, as I destroy the background, is Jim Bintliff. And as you can see there, it's the mud guy. And this is memorabilia. Doesn't look like there's any mud on his shirt, sweater, whatever that is. And last but certainly not least, we got to have some basketball so we'll get something from Monopoly. It just came out. It's Jimmy Butler. You get two more of those, and you own the entire block, and then you can put up hotels and beat your opponent, or however that game works. I don't know. I just think it's kind of a cool card, and somebody might want that. Anyway, I'd like to thank you for joining us for eBay sales from the week, along with 10 cool new listings at the eBay store, the baseball card illustrated eBay store, that is. I'd like to thank Driller for joining us, Showtime for his camera work, and, of course, Kevin the Diamond King and our graphics guru, Dylan. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite card was this week. And if you're new here, we'd love to have you jump aboard. Please hit that subscribe button, and you can catch all the future videos. Thanks for watching, everybody. This has been the Baseball Card Illustrated channel.